1,000 Canadians who needed a kidney transplant got one through a kidney exchange program. Nearly 300 of them live in BC. The kidney paired donation program matches pairs of patients and living donors together if they're incompatible with the people they know. A medical director of transplants at Vancouver General Hospital says this is a major milestone. If we're taking 1,000 people off the deceased donor waiting list, that makes the waiting time shorter for those who are on it and um, also the complexity of the people that are on it. A living donation gives people um, a chance to avoid dialysis, avoid waiting and get a better quality organ. She says in BC, the demand for kidneys outweighs the supply. 30,000 people have chronic kidney disease and thousands are in line for a transplant. One couple in Surrey says they felt defeated. Devin Graywall grew up with kidney problems, but his wife Mandeep's blood type wasn't compatible. They both found out they had a match on Valentine's Day. I pretty much threw my hands in the air and jumped up and said, I got a kidney. And now two months after after the operation, Devin says he's back to his old self. When we were able to leave the hospital and I got home, I could instantly feel my energy like increasing rapidly. I got compliments like saying that, you know, I started getting color back in my face and like my hair was getting more good. Like I could just, I could feel everything going back to normal the way it was before I went on to dialysis. Mandeep, who donated her kidney, says she's still recovering. I'm still kind of dealing with a little bit of lack of energy, but overall now at kind of the, the, almost at the two, two month mark feeling a lot better and almost, I would say, back to normal. Dr. Johnston says the paired donations get matched faster in most cases than staying on the deceased donor waiting list. The Greywalls don't regret joining the program. You don't realize how many people are going through this. As soon as you talk to somebody about it, somebody knows somebody who's going through it. I was just happy to be helping, you know, Devin and, and getting his life back. And then at the same time, helping somebody else um, with that too. In Vancouver, Sarah Chu, City News.